Hello, hello, hello. It's the Fireside Creator and I'm back with another recipe. Today I'm preparing baked turkey wings with gravy served with green beans over a bed of rice. Let's start baking. Place your turkey wings in your baking dish and pour vegetable oil all over the skin of these wings. Then you're going to rub the oil on both sides of these wings. By using this oil, it will help the spices adhere to the wings better. Preparing these turkey wings do not require a lot of ingredients. All you need is your spices and a few vegetables. And we are ready to start cooking. When you have time, preheat your oven on 375 degrees. The next thing that I'm going to do is start seasoning my turkey wings. The first seasoning I'm going to use is onion powder and chili powder. When you're applying the seasonings, sprinkle enough to cover the top of the turkey wings. Next, I'm going to use accent and parsley. Then black pepper and Old Bay. The last seasoning that I'm going to add to my turkey wings is smoked paprika and basil. Now you want to rub these seasonings on the front and back of your turkey wings. If you're watching this video and you haven't subscribed, take some time out and subscribe, hit your notification bell, continue watching this video, and then comment in the comment box below. And please don't forget to hit your like button. Continue applying seasoning to your turkey wings. You want to make sure you get in the cracks and crevices of your wings because when you bite into any part of your wings, you want to make sure that it has enough flavor. Then sprinkle the garlic on top of the wings and add the onions into the dish as well. Thank you. 
These onions were thinly sliced to add more flavor to the dish. Now pour water on the side of the pan, but not directly on top of the wings because it will wash away the wings seasonings. You wanna add just enough water to cover the bottom of the pan. Adding water to your chicken will help to make more broth. Next, add a slice of butter to the top of each turkey wing. I'm going to place my turkey wings covered in my preheated oven for an hour. While my turkey wings are baking in the oven, I'm going to start on my green beans and potatoes. You're going to need butter, garlic, seasoning, potatoes, onions, and green beans. I have two pounds of green beans that have been washed and ready to be prepped. On the side of the green beans, snap off each end. This next step is optional. You can either break the green beans in half or leave them whole and place them in your pan. Snapping green beans can be time consuming. As a child, I used to snap green beans and I used to hate it because we had big buckets of green beans to snap. Next, I'm cutting up six red potatoes into chunks and discarding the pieces that are not edible, like the little brown spots. And then I'm adding the rest of the potatoes to the pan. Let's add the potatoes in the pan with the green beans. Then add in the diced onions and garlic. Now we want to season the green beans with black pepper and Old Bay. Smoked 
paprika, and Creole seasoning. Next, pour in some water, just enough to cook the green beans and potatoes. Over medium heat, I'm gonna boil these green beans and potatoes for about 25 minutes. Add in a few slices of butter. Also, I'm gonna add a little bit of apple cider vinegar for flavor. This is what the green beans and potatoes look like after 25 minutes. And also, I've added in some more red potatoes off camera. I've just taken the wings out of the oven and they have been cooking for an hour. I poured off the broth in a separate container and I'm gradually adding flour to my broth to make gravy. The broth and flour is what I'm using to make gravy. The flour helps to thicken the broth and then I'm gonna add it back in to the pan with the turkey wings. Now I'm going to place the wings back into the oven for an additional 40 minutes or until the meat is tender enough and falling off the bone. This is how the wings turned out after an hour and 40 minutes. If you like this video, please like, comment, and subscribe. Don't forget to hit your notification bell and share my channel with everybody in your contacts. Bye.